Let us go now to uh, JR is going to throw it to Gordon Soley, who's in the dressing room area. And this is followed by Sting and RoboCop. Here it is. <laughs> Why? Why are they out there? <laughs> I love the Secret Service guys and shit. <laughs> I'm point that. Is saying that's an actor, right? You know that's a good it is. It's like getting Superman. And there's Christopher Reeves. Like Superman is here. Superman is here. And it's Christopher Reeves. You're like, well, it's an actor. It's a from a move. No, that that that's Superman. That's Superman, bro. That shit's real, bro. Superman's real. He's going to fly to the ring. <laughs> uh, I'm Hopper. Look at the Secret Service guy with the hand <laughs> to the ear like he's talking on the earpiece. <laughs> Let's go now to Gordon Soli. <laughs> It looks like something's going on down here. The doors have opened. Security men are coming out. And it looks like, yes, it is indeed Sting and Robocop are making their way out to the arena. Robocop listening as he comes out through the light. And he can... Well, I'll tell you one thing. Four horsemen watch out on Sting. Watch it. Stand by. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we apologize for uh, for that. Uh, someone per- per- apparently has grabbed the camera. And ladies and gentlemen, the nation one law enforcer. He serves the public trust, protects the innocent, upholds the law, the ultimate peace officer, RoboCop. Great ovation for RoboCop as he makes his way to the ring. He'll be coming into our camera view here. Now the, wait a minute, the horsemen are already up. They just threw Sting in the cage. They just threw Sting in the cage that Cornette was in. Sting has been tased by the horseman, but here comes RoboCop, Bob. Sid Vicious, Ole Anderson, Arn Anderson, they all attacked him, threw him into the cage. But well, look at RoboCop now as he's approaching. He is not they're, in, back, they're backing away from him. He's not intimidated, Bob. RoboCop going right to the cage. This You're going to be a bucket of balls when we get down with you. Oh, gosh almighty. He's pulling that door right off the hinges. Uh, Woohoo! What strength by Robocop! And then he won a piece of him, Horseman! <laughs> Look at Ole and Hart and, and Big Sid back up uh, and the expression on their faces they say, What the heck have we got here? They say there'll be another day when, when Anderson, when Ole Anderson saw Robocop pull that, that steel door right off the cage, they said, We better wait for another day. Sting and Robocop have asserted themselves here. Sting looks phenomenal. He looks to be 100%, Bob. He and his buddy Robocop. I tell you, the horseman wanted no part of either of those, especially the Stinger and Robocop. Let's go back up now to Gary Capetta. Harper, you've been dying to talk about this on the Saturday Night Show. Let's have it. Uh, Okay. In the beginning, when he leave the locker room why is there a fucking smoke machine in the fucking locker room doc do you have an answer for for our great superstar i don't and the one thing that i don't understand is if he's there to help luger and protect against the horseman why did they come out two matches before that one and and then why did robocop come out and fucking rip the goddamn cage apart with fucking uh Flair and, and, and fucking Luger. Maybe Robocop one. maybe Robocop had to be back on the studio lot before nine PM. Yeah, maybe he needed a fucking oil change. <laughs> I was thinking he um, had to fly back to Detroit to to yeah. you know <laughs> protect the city there, you know, as quick as he moves. Yeah. <laughs> um well, let let Hopper keep going, Doc. Let let let's. Uh, I want Hopper to get all his stuff in that he's been waiting to talk I'm about. I'm thinking, what do you think is going through fucking Arn and fucking Oli that's been doing this for fucking forever from Georgia Championship Wrestling, and he's like, I got fucking RoboCop staring me down. We're I think they're both thinking that maybe Dusty and Jim Crockett weren't so bad after all. Yeah. Remember, Oli's Oli's booking now, I believe. Which is crazy to think, you know, I guess he's just pinned me, paid me to herd. Yeah. At this point, just being okay with this. Uh, 
fucking RoboCop. Uh, it's, RoboCop's okay. here. It's, um, what? It's Hopper, just he... so stupid, bro. I mean, like and I said, it's so stupid. It's like every happened. part of it. Every part of it, they missed the camera angle. It, it's like fucking Michael Keaton dressed as Batman. You're like, that's fucking Michael Keaton. No, that's Batman, motherfucker. That's that's Bat. No, that's Michael. Ke- no, that's Batman. That's Batman. Right. It, it's just- Basically, it's a fictional character that they made. Yes. This is like having and- He-Man come out. Our fucking Optimus Prime. <laughs> Transformer. Get the smoke machine in the back. We got RoboCop oh, coming God. out. Okay, Hopper, I want you to get it all out. What else? It's just it's 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 so stupid. I mean, don't get me wrong. If I was a little kid watching this shit, I'd be like, oh my god. But dude, what the fuck? It's so dumb. And the thing is, people say, oh, what about you know WWF? They had fucking Mr. T and Zeus, but that was Mr. T. That was Zeus. And and you could do things with them and have, you know, matches with them in a controlled situation. You can't do shit with RoboCop. You can't tag in fucking RoboCop for the hot tag. What the fuck is he going to do? Here, I'm going to jump in real quick. Here's my favorite part. And Doc, I want your thoughts. Sting is being locked up right now. First off, they fucking bent one of the bars uh, while Oops. they were locking Sting up. <laughs> Sting is Sting is being locked up. RoboCop's moving as fast as he can. Boy, that's a fucking <laughs> hell of a crime fighter right there. Bruh, bruh, that's what I'm saying. How could he stop people? You just run. <laughs> you could walk away from him. Uh, I didn't mind the first RoboCop movie for the record. Uh, oh, yeah, it's, oh yeah, the first one was fucking awesome. I'll still watch the first one. But to the point you're making, I love the best then, line, bro. Bitches leave. You remember that with the two prostitutes? <laughs> That's a nice, Hopper. <laughs> um, okay, Doc. I've I've said some things. I, I you got any other thoughts besides what we've already talked about? If there were such a machine in real life as a reverse money printer, (laughs) this segment would be it. What do you think WWF was fucking thinking? They didn't even have a clue this happened. (laughs) I wonder what WCW made by doing this because it's basically I bet, they, I bet they paid for this dude i was wondering like uh, you know what was the fucking you know the pay-per-view buys for this like you know did it pay off i can find out from lance um it took years off my lance. life yeah i mean he he he's got all those old observers he could tell you what they are well see because i'm thinking what the robocop people pay them because they're promoting the fucking movie yeah, that's but this what is I was. WCW. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I was like, I felt like they would RoboCop the over the production company, whoever, basically looked at this as a paid ad, and they were just yeah. you know paying right. for publicity. That's how it's I looked commercial. at it. Yeah, yeah. the The other thing that's that's Doc has pointed to this. This is it. This is the RoboCop segment. So, you know. What did he exactly do to help Luger out? Um, I mean, this is it. That's it. The horsemen run off, and that's a segment just like that. You've seen RoboCop. If you missed it, and I don't know what to tell and, you. And and this was what they're they have been promoting, and it's three. It goes on before the Rock and Roll Freebird match. Bruh, what are we doing? I thought that sign just now behind Sting said lick ass. No, it says kick ass. ass. I know, but you can't see the L in the I at first. Go Luger, Luger, go for it. Kick ass. Kick ass, yeah. 
Okay, all I saw and, was the CKS. And lick ass. <laughs> all right, keep going. Uh, Doc, any other thoughts? This is this is dumb. We are straying too far away from the Lord here. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Hopper, uh, I want to come back at the end of this. I want to ask you what Tiffany said, but I know Doc's running against the clock tonight, so let's keep going. Yeah. Uh, 